Andrew Little and welcome to World at War News. Tonight we will be talking about a horrible time in World War II and we have two special guests to help us with this topic. After the recent discovery of a short-term resurrection serum, we have inven we've invited Adolf Hitler and one of his vic victims to ha talk to them about the Holocaust. So, Mr. Hitler, do you have any regrets about what you've done? No. Okay. If you had one wish, what would it be? To rid the world of all other foul beings. What would be your preferred way to die? I, I would have never died. I would have led the fatherland forever. And who do you consider the most evil man in history? Jesus is, is easily the most evil man that has ever lived. Okay, now we have our next guest who will be talking to us about his life in the camps. Thank you for coming. Please welcome Shoal Davidov. Thank you, Andrew. Okay, Shoal, what exactly are death camps? Death camps, or extermination camps, were killing centres designed and built by Nazi soldiers in Germany in World War II. These camps systematically killed millions of Jews, Slavs and communists, and others who Nazi soldiers did not think were as superior as themselves, by getting as well as executing us through extreme work under starvation. How did men and wo women get into these camps? It was simple. Hitler decided that the people weren't superior in his eyes, for example. He liked blue-eyed people, but disliked brown-eyed people. Men and wo women were rounded up by Nazi soldiers who would then deliver them to the camps they were sought for them. The first prisoners were political opponents of the Nazi party. After Hitler defeated them, he put them in the camps to suffer. Did the men and women in the camps have any different experiences? I believe so. My experience was very horrid. We had to do our inhuman forced labour. We were treated brutally and most of us died of starvation. But women, however, were sometimes had it worse. Pregnant women in the camps were sent to guest chambers straight away. Also, before entering the camps, the men and women would have to strip naked in front of the guards to be cleaned, but many women who have to stand naked in front of men. They didn't know how, how, would be, how embarrassed they'd be and would even cry. What were the purpose for these camps? The purpose for the camps that were open was to kill Jews and other ethnicities Hitler disliked as quickly as possible. As they arrived, the victims went directly to gas chambers and later thrown into the crematorium. The causes of death for millions of people in the death camps was from starvation, being worked to death, exposure to elements, epidemics, and disease. What was Hitler's final solution? His final solution was to exterminate all Jews during the time period of World War II. The final solution of the Jewish question was the Nazi code name for the plan to murder all Jews within reach. We have one last question for you, Shaw. What was your opinion on the Holocaust? I thought this period of time could possibly be one of the worst times in history. I'm not going to mention his name, but that man was a murderer and a psycho. We were treated terribly, and so many of my ethnicity were exterminated. I am very lucky to be alive today to tell you all the information I know. Thank you, Shaw. Well, that's been World of War News. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time for even more information about horrible times in history. Good night. A horrible time in World War Two, and we have two special guests to help us with this. Oh God! <laughs> so, Mr. Hitler, do you have any regrets about what you've done? Nine. <laughs> <laughs>